One day, while out hunting wild pigs in the bush, the tropical cowboy was ambushed by a large mob of the animals. He had been tracking a particularly large and elusive pig and had not been paying attention to his surroundings. Suddenly, he found himself surrounded by dozens of snarling and aggressive pigs with no way to escape. The tropical cowboy knew that he was in grave danger. He knew that if he didn't act quickly, he would be overwhelmed and killed by the pig. He quickly assessed his situation and decided to use his only weapon, his guitar and his pocket knife. He unsheathed his pocket knife and held it in one hand, ready to defend himself. In his other hand, he picked up his guitar and strummed it fiercely, creating a loud and discordant sound. The pigs were startled by the noise and hesitated for a moment, giving the tropical cowboy the opportunity to strike. With lightning speed, the tropical cowboy lunged forward, using his pocket knife to stab and slash at the pigs. He was a skilled hunter, and he knew how to take down his prey. He was precise and deadly, and in no time, he had killed several pigs. As the pig began to attack him, the tropical cowboy fought back with his guitar. He swung it wildly, using it to bash and smash the pigs. The pigs were caught off guard by this unusual weapon and were unable to defend themselves. The battle was brutal and intense, but the tropical cowboy was determined to survive. He fought with all his might, using his guitar and his pocket knife to take down the pigs one by one. He was covered in blood and sweat, but he refused to back down.
Finally, the last pig fell to the ground, and the tropical cowboy was victorious. He was exhausted and injured, but he had managed to survive the attack. He had killed every pig in the mob, using only his guitar and his pocket knife. Tropical Cowboy knew that he had been lucky to survive the attack. He knew that he had been foolish to let his guard down, and he vowed to always be more careful in the future. But he also knew that he had proven to himself that he was a true cowboy, and that he was capable of anything.
The battle was brutal and intense, but the tropical cowboy was determined to survive. He fought with all his might, using his guitar and his pocket knife to take down the pigs one by one. He was covered in blood and sweat, but he refused to back down. From that day on, the tropical cowboy was known throughout North Queensland as the cowboy who had defeated a mob of wild pigs with only his guitar and his pocket knife. He was a legend, and his reputation as a skilled hunter and a fearless warrior was cemented in the minds of the people. He continued to live his life in the wild and untamed landscape of North Queensland, hunting pigs, distilling his unique style of rum, and playing his guitar to the stars in the night sky. He was a true cowboy, and he would always be remembered as the Tropical Cowboy.